Hello and welcome, RX Plus viewers. Again, this is Dr. Maria Lourdes Escobar, your doc on duty for today. At ang topic natin ngayon ay tungkol sa isang message mula sa nagngangalang Wendy Katigbak. At worried siya, baka daw mamana ng kanyang magiging anak ang kanyang sakit sa puso. At heto ang sabi niya. Hi po, Doc! Nadiagnose po ako dati na may PDA or Patent Ductus Arteriosus. Posible bang magkakomplikasyon ako kapag nagdadalang tao na ako? O mapapasa ko rin ba yung sakit ko sa aking magiging anak? Kung magkaroon man ng PDA ang anak ko, mabibigyang lunas ba siya? Okay, Miss Wendy, we have here with us today Dr. Dexter Eugene Cheng, a pediatric interventional cardiologist from the Los Santos Medical Center. Siya po ang sasagot sa inyong mga concerns. Doc, may katotohanan ba ang mga agam-agam ni Miss Wendy? To answer yung tanong ni Wendy, yung patent doctor's arteriosus po ay isang butas sa loob ng puso na hindi pinagmanahan. It's something na lahat tayo kapag nanganak po ay nandun na ho. Habang nasa womb po tayo ay normal, pag nalabas po tayo ay dapat kusang magsasara. So maybe three or four per thousand na hindi talaga nagsasara. So kung si Wendy ay may patent doctor's arteriosus at adult na ho siya, ay madali na rin i-close yan. No? We can put a device in without opening the chest anymore to close most of these as long as yung baga ng patient is still normal. Sometimes kasi nasisira dahil sa PDA. Pero yung isang tanong niya, will her unborn child also have the PDA? Yes, we'll all have PDA. So, pero nga, kadalasan, they will all also close dapat. So, kailangan lang bantayan. Okay. Yung PDA, kapag hindi nasara, if it's small, there's really no consequence. So, most families feel na wala naman kung sakit yung bata. But if you listen to the chest, maririnig nyo, nakakaiba yung tunog. Pero kung if it's moderate or large in size, maybe 4 or 5 millimeters or bigger, that one is like a faucet that's on, nababaha yung kanilang baga, and then they become very sick. They have cough and colds often, or minsan nakakabronco pneumonia ho sila. Madalas, once or twice a year, which is already very dangerous. Kasi nakakamatay rin yung pneumonia, dagdag nyo pa ho dyan sakit sa puso. The solution is very simple now. No? Um, compared to before where kailangan pa operahin, open the chest with surgery and stay in the ICU for several days, now the solution is minimally invasive. There is no more cutting open the chest. May, may idadaan lang parang suero sa singit and then 30 minutes later, an hour later, it's all, all done and there's really no pain. So it's minimally invasive, it's like magic. This procedure that we do now for PDA closure is done in a cardiac cath lab. So, in this hospital where we're in, we have a very new and very nice cardiac cath lab. So, for you, Wendy, and for all the viewers and listeners, my suggestion is if you still have a patent ductus arteriosus and you're an adult, we should have it closed as soon as you can. And it's done safely here at De Los Santos Medical Center at the catheterization laboratory unit. Before you get pregnant then, the suggestion is you should have it closed because if the PDA is still there and you're pregnant, it's going to be more difficult during your pregnancy for you and for your baby. The other question was, what if you're already pregnant? Then you should actually see a specialist for your OB to make sure that we can carry your pregnancy to term and then take care of you after, take care of your PDA and your heart after you deliver. Thank you, Dr. Cheng, for that expert advice. So, Ms. Wendy, I hope na liwanagan ka sa lahat ng mga sinabi ng ating guest doctor ngayon. And once again, sa lahat ng ating mga televiewers, kung may gusto kayong malaman tungkol sa inyong mga health issues, just send us a message through our Facebook page, Rx+. Again, this is Dr. Maria Lourdes Escobar, your doc on duty for today.